Whoa, look how weird the weather is right now. Gray clouds and bam, you have sunshine over there. <laughs> Alan and I just finished at the bank and Alan's holding the deathly check right now. <laughs> because tomorrow we're actually meeting with our lawyers and we're going to sign the papers and finalize everything and give her that check as well. So. Yeah, our bank account went from here to <laughs> flat line. <laughs> That's what happens when you're a homeowner now. So we're super excited guys. It's finally getting really real. Well, it's getting real because we have no money in our bank account. <laughs> Just kidding, we still have money, but you know, it's less money, but overall, money. yeah. It's worth it though! We are at Red Robin's right now for dinner. I got the Royal Red Robin burger, which has a fried egg, bacon, beef, cheese, yummy. <laughs> and then to be good, I got a garden salad on the side and we got, this is the bomb.com. Their honey, <laughs> poppy seed, mustard, dressing. <laughs> And then Alan got, what do you have in? I got a guacamole burger just to be healthy. Somewhat healthy. Yeah. And he likes his ciabatta bread. Yes, because I don't like burger buns. Yeah. And then we got a side of fries. And of course, we asked for more because who doesn't love their fries? Yeah, who doesn't love going like this? Mm. I'm going like oh. Jelly. <laughs> what a tiring day that was today. After dinner, Linda and I went to Costco and look what we bought. We went there to buy a KitchenAid stand mixer because it was on sale. Alan wanted it for so long. It was on sale one time, but I'm like, nah, we don't need a KitchenAid. Ever since he started making cookies and desserts and everything, I'm like, yeah, we need a KitchenAid stand. <laughs> it went back on sale this week. So. Yeah, so because it went back on sale for the exact same price I wanted to buy it for before, we went to go pick it up today. Yeah, we got it in black because it'll match our Vitamix. Yeah, originally we wanted the white one, but the white one's also $10 more, so I'm like, eh, not worth $10. Yeah. So we got a black one, and now we're gonna chow down on some dessert. Blizzard. Oh, yummy. Right now, GQ has Kit Kat flavor. They're mm -hmm. special. I guess they have it every month, they're special. Yeah. And then we got turtles as well. So this is our dessert, guys, and we're watching How I Met Your Mother on Netflix because. My sister and brother does not have cable. cable, so we can't watch our Keeping Up with the Kardashians. <laughs> no, I didn't really want to watch that. I just wanted to watch Marvel, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Oh yeah, all of the new shows are out this week. Uh-huh, and we missed all. all of them. I know, like Marvel, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Big Bang Theory, Modern Family, Rain, Rain. what else is there? A lot of CW stuff. Yeah. Arrow's probably out soon. And I missed Flash. Kim Kardashian's wedding on Keeping Up With <clears throat> Kardashians. The week we moved was the one I recorded of her wedding. And <laughs> our cable box is in storage. Gee! <laughs> I know. I guess Alan doesn't care. About the Kardashians? No. Not one bit. <laughs> Dummy. Why, but when I buy Dairy Queen ice cream, I don't like it when it's freshly made, like the ice cream is soft serve. I actually like to go home, freeze it, and when it's this consistency, like hard, I find it tastes better. Do you guys do that too, or is it just me? <laughs> I think she's the only weirdo. <laughs> so basically, when we want to eat Blizzard, we have to plan it. <laughs> like, she wants to eat it on a Thursday, we have to go to, on a Wednesday to buy it, <laughs> cap it, tie it up, put it in the freezer so we can eat it on Thursday. But look, it's so good, all hard and stuff. Mmm. So it's a planned thing, it's not a splur splur splurge of the moment. <laughs> splurge yeah. of the moment. <laughs> but I, know, I don't know, I find the flavor comes out more when it's like the ice cream is hard like this. I'm not weird, right guys? Good morning everybody, so I am... Just finished up my makeup and I'm trying a new um, lippy, also a new bronzer and a new mascara. So I'll be doing a review or a few reviews on my main channel. But I really, really like this lippy that I'm trying out. It's the Sonia Kesha has her new like fall makeup out. So I bought a few things from her collection. This one is um, her Lustrous Shine Lip Crayon in Dahlia 01 absolutely love it and I think this is so far the best kind of like crayon type lippy I've ever tried it goes on so smoothly and as you guys can see the color is so pigmented up close and personal <laughs> but I just love this kind of like it's kind of like a berry like vampy dark color so I love that but I'm just waiting for Alan right now and we are what are we doing we are probably going to go um, 
to one of the furniture stores because um, as you guys know it's fall time so all of like their patio furniture this is when you shop for patio furniture even though there's no use for it anymore it's like all like more than half off so we're gonna head there and see if we can find um we want like a kind of like a dining table for the patio and we want it a little bit higher so probably probably like um counter height or whatever just a table and like four chairs because we already have our patio um, sectional and coffee table and that's pretty much will complete our patio furniture so that's what we're gonna do and then afterwards we are headed into Richmond of course to do our usual grocery Friday <laughs> and um, right after that or before that we're gonna head to our lawyers get all the documents signed and of course give her the deadly check and then um, yeah and then everything will be signed sealed done and delivered and then we are we actually booked our movers for this coming thursday so that's when we're gonna move we're gonna meet them at that storage area and then they're gonna pick it all up and then we're into our new house so i'm super excited and then um we get our keys on what is it i think tuesday so that tuesday i'm gonna get the keys and then film a entire empty house tour for you guys I'm so excited and because we haven't seen um, our house for so long and plus I'm so excited to film it for you guys so you guys can see every nook and cranny of our new place because you guys are gonna get used to it because on the vlog you're obviously gonna be in our house with us so so excited to do that and too bad Alan's working that day too because I know he really wants to go with me and uh, film it with me so we will probably go there probably Wednesday night before our big move and then just check it out again, soak it all in before all of our furniture arrives and stuff. So today's going to be super fun and eventful. <laughs> Look at Alan. This is how he tests out the chairs. <laughs> just in case it wiggles, but this is pretty nice. I think we're going to grab this one because it's on sale right now. I know. What is it? Regular price for the chair, $2.99, and it's $1.26 now. Yeah, so it's like 60 to 65%. Yeah, and it comes with these four chairs. And it's pretty high. It's like a counter height. So not bad. You can still see the view and everything. Mm -hmm. That's why I want high. Too bad it wasn't high. But I guess if it's too high, it won't be safe for us to sit on. Yeah, but it's really nice, though. It's like a, I guess, a black color. Comes with the glass. And it seems pretty sturdy. It's the brand, let's see, it's called Retana. And I've seen some of this brand from like, like outdoor coffee shops and stuff. So it's pretty nice. They have some really cool pieces here. I'm at Moe's home collection and I really like this kind of cool architectural lamp here for like, you know, beside the sectional. Very cool, but this thing's $700, so expensive. And I also like that chandelier there. It's pretty cool too. Yay! Phew. That only took two hours yeah, though. Only two hours. <laughs> but we finished at the lawyer's office. Everything was signed, sealed, and it's gonna be delivered. So mm. oh, finally, and we got like this huge package yeah. of like Papers. all the documents we signed pretty much. <laughs> it's like thick, thick. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we were there. Our appointment was at two at the lawyer's <laughs> office, and now it's almost 4:30. So that was a long long time but it was good though so very informative yeah she went through like everything and you know we have to ask questions and stuff and it's just very good like clear crystal clear to us so now for something we're now heading to grocery shopping now we're doing our grocery friday <laughs> <laughs> i know but i'm so tired already i don't, even, don't even want to do yeah. it yeah we're so excited because on tuesday we get our key <clears throat> finally, finally! Like I cannot believe I'm actually vlogging this and telling you guys we're getting our keys. Like, I know. It's just it's, so unbelievable. Yeah, it's, but we've been waiting so long and so have you. <laughs> I know, so have you guys. But soon enough I'll have the um, empty home tour for you guys. So that'll as be... soon as she gets the key, she's gonna go through the whole thing yeah. while I'm at work. Yeah. <laughs> when I get the keys, I'm gonna bring camera, my tripod, and set everything up, and then I can show Ellen the home <laughs> tour too. <laughs> I know, I won't get to see it. <laughs> Ellen and I are crunching on time right now because we have to go grocery shopping, so we just ate at a food court mm -hmm. um, near the grocery store. Yes. Ellen got one of the beef and What is it? 
I, I just picked potatoes and I picked a kimchi because I like the potatoes. Mm, so they're so sweet. Mm -hmm. Sweet and yummy. Yep. I got soup. <laughs> Alan got some sort of beef roll from TNT. Got some sushi. Mm, look at that mayo. <laughs> <laughs> and then, of course, I got this um, black this rice roll that I showed you guys last week. Really, really good. But we're gonna <laughs> dig in now because we're so hungry. And we ordered a lot of food. Mm -hmm. Good morning, everybody. Morning. <laughs> Today we're making French toast for breakfast, and I made it for the whole family. They all loved it. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> but to show you what it is, all we did bought was some. Um, what's this Can stuff you turn called? Off the back? Oh. So loud. Too loud. Bought some egg bread, sweet egg bread, which is basically Chinese version of brioche. Put egg in it, and I bought this stuff to put it in the middle. Hainanese kaya with honey. Mm -hmm. And it's, oh, I didn't make anything. Yeah, it's a gem that's in the middle. And everyone said it tastes awesome, it just tastes like it. So if you guys want to make Asian style French toast, here it is. And there's the finished product. There's you put the... a little bit of oil, right? Mm-hmm, I just cooked it with a little bit of oil because I don't want to deep fry it like the Chinese cafes do. <laughs> Even though it tastes super good, it's just kind of unhealthy and it's a lot of oil they put in there. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna have for breakfast. And we bought some milk tea yesterday at TNT. Oh yeah, so we can have like a real Asian style. <coughs> Hong Kong style. Yeah, Hong Kong style. <laughs> Hong Kong style French toast breakfast. Mmm, yeah. look at those. Who's that actor on this bottle? That's Jackie Chan. Oh, Jackie Chan? Not Jackie Chan, but oh. a guy named Jung Ho Yao. He's a singer. Oh, interesting. Mmm, let's see what this one tastes like. Because I know this one, if you guys ever see it at your local Asian markets, this one actually tastes really good. I Instagrammed the matcha one so good. It feels like you're in, like, you know when you go to Asia and it's like, you go to like... 7-Eleven? Um, yeah, and you buy those drinks. Mmm, so good. Special delivery! And voila! Breakfast is ready. Ready for what? Instagram picture! Oh, Ready don't for mind that? This guy. <laughs> it didn't break my whole wardrobe as you Isn't she know. sexy? She's wearing my sexy basketball shorts. Hey, look shorts. at his shorts though. It got caught up in the dryer. dryer. <laughs> yeah, the dryer had this little nick in it and brand new shorts all nicked up. Nicked up. <laughs> Became my sleeping shorts. Instagram. Such a beautiful fall morning. Ellen and I took over my parents' car yeah, and we and totally like to go all the seats and everything to make room because we're picking up our dining table, yep. our patio set, and that's it. <laughs> yeah, and that's it. But it's so awesome having one of these cars. It's, I thought it was like really small in the beginning, and then I started playing around with it. All the seats came up. I'm like, <gasps> we totally have room to pick up everything. I know it's like a van style. We took out all their chairs and everything in the back as well. So definitely have enough room for the furniture that we're about to pick up. Yeah, it's so handy to have one of these compared to our little car. I know. But um, yeah, after we pick up the furniture, we're going to drop it off at storage and then we're smart because we're going to let the movers move into our new place because yeah. we ain't lugging that thing up the stairs and everything. Uh, I don't know how heavy that dining table is going to be that it's glass. I don't like, I thought of it was like, do I want to lift that thing all the way up to the second floor by myself? <laughs> so I was like, no, let's hurry up, pick it up so the movers can do all the work. Yeah, because I have no upper body strength at all. <laughs> no, she's got one of those arms that go like this and it goes... <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. But, um, so funny, this car, you guys want to hear a funny story? It was actually, like, passed down from sibling to sibling ever since we were in high school. So I guess my dad got really lazy to drive us. He's like, oh, just... Uh, take the car and like drive it to school. So this was my car in high school guys. It was a RAV4 I remember I was so cool. I was driving to school by myself because all my siblings Graduated already and I was the only one in high school And I was like I was one of the cool kids. I got uh, my own car to drive to school what a lucky kid. <laughs> So spoiled. Yeah, it's funny because we actually I think my parents liked this car so much they actually bought two like back then and then they now they sold it but they kept this one which is like you know the leather one and everything so yeah this was my ride back then guys <laughs> it's so funny you can tell they don't drive it very much because i'm looking at the odometer there's only 59,000 kilometers on it and this thing's like probably what 10 years old yeah and i've got a two-year-old car and it's got 49,000 kilometers on it <laughs> i know they don't drive much they just you know just go grocery shopping come home or whatever but yeah 
So cool. Brings back a lot of memories mm -hmm. of high school. Here's Alan's cart. Here's mine. <laughs> Alan's like, why do you need a cart for that? I'm like, why hold when you can push? <laughs> but here's our small storage room. Well, this is one out of the two. Yeah, this one. I guess it's, we still need it because we couldn't fit everything on the other Yeah, we've got to rearrange so we can fit our patio stuff. So cool. They even saran wrapped it for us, which is nice. And this too. This is the table. Oh, that's the legs. Oh, our cups. Ooh. Yeah, don't break my cups again, hun. <laughs> again. <laughs> Because we could barely fit our table into the car, we had to move Linda's seat all the way up to the front. Look. So the no res room. Yeah, no room. no room. She couldn't get in, so the result is me, right here. I'm gonna look like I'm sitting and I'm gonna put my seat belt. Such a gentleman. Um, no seat belt, but I'm just gonna like, you know, put it over my shoulder so it looks like there's something there. <laughs> And because I didn't want Linda to be uncomfortable back here, so... Aww, look at what uh, a sweet hubby he is. I know. I don't freaking know where I'm going, though. <laughs> but don't worry, I'll tell you where to go. Okay, let's go.